Family, the sound of planes taking off here at the Tupelo Airport are the exact thing that inspired native Tupelo native rather Alric Riley to follow his dream and become a flight attendant. Well, because of coronavirus and the effects of it on airlines, that dream could be coming to an end. I was raised in the North Mississippi area, so being raised on a small farm, I would see planes flying overhead, and I always wanted to know what was going on. And soon after graduation, Alaric Riley made that dream come true. He became an American Airlines flight attendant. But because of the coronavirus, that dream of being in the air is now up in the air. We were told to have hope. We had hope for so long that a, a stimulus bill or some kind of relief would happen after October. However, after the airline's failed attempt for additional federal funds, Riley, along with many of his co-workers, lost their jobs. And now they're playing politics with our lives, and it's not okay for them to be able to have their six-figure salaries or their, their, their good health care and all of that, and now you, are, you have people that they have different livelihoods, and now it's all at stake now. Alaric says he is now working a part-time job, not yet able to find a full-time position. A day-to-day -day would look like possibly doing a few interviews. He says right now he is learning to find his way out of the air and on the ground. This is going to be a journey and it's, it's hard. Which is why he says now more than ever, he urges people to vote, not only for presidential elections, but also state and local elections. Right now, the aspects of what's going on and with COVID or with the airline industry, we honestly can't control that. But one thing you can't control is yourself. Now, after speaking with Riley, he did also tell me that although he has been furloughed to be after being a flight attendant, he is keeping his hopes high that they will return back to work and he will be able to carry out that dream. However, he said that in the meantime, he is working toward his second passion, which is marketing and advertising. For now, reporting live in Tupelo, Aaron Wilson, WTVA 9 News.